Hello guys, today I want to present to you my new component on LiveWire Kit, added 36th component, which is auto saving post draft in the background. And I'm getting closer to the 39 mark of 39 components when I will raise the price for LiveWire Kit. So current price is $29 for all the components. When I reach 39 components sometime in 22 quite soon, I guess, the price will go up to $39 respectively. So you can still get it at the current price. And topic of today is this last new component. How does it work? In the demo, you can create, for example, a post and new post, for example, some text, whatever. And then every 10 seconds, this happens. Saved at such and such time. And then you can continue editing and edit something. And then at some point, every 10 seconds, this will get refreshed. And then what do we have in the database? So in the database table of posts, we do have that record, auto saved, but then also we have revisions. It's similar to what WordPress does or any other platforms like Google Docs, probably Medium does that as well. I don't remember actually. But basically you don't need to save every time and you're kind of protected from losing your data if something crashes like in your browser or something. So post revisions will contain all the revisions saved every 10 seconds with title and post text. And if nothing has been changed since the last revision, like I'm talking now, I'm not doing any changes. Although this still happening every 10 seconds is just updating the updated ad of the last revision. So I refresh, as you can see that timestamp has changed, but the post text field didn't. Now, how does it work in the code? In the blade file, the main blade file, you just load live wire component and all the form is actually live wire component, which is this one called create component. Maybe it should have been called post create or something like that for better naming. Anyway, you use render to render the blade template of that live wire component. For my live work, you have also another variable of design template because every component comes with bootstrap and tailwind version. So that's irrelevant for the actual usage. And now what we have inside of this form, this is a regular live wire form with wire submit with wire model for the fields. But the main logic, the main magic comes from this one wire poll every 10 seconds, it will call the draft method. What is draft method inside of the component? We have this. So if we don't have the post ID yet, we validate, we save the post, then we get the ID of that post and then we save the revision. Otherwise, if there's any field changed like title or post text, then again, we validate, we update the existing post and we create another revision. Otherwise, if nothing was changed, we get all the revisions latest and touch the last row, which is just basically updating the updated ad field. And then the whole form is submitted to publish, which is doing almost the same thing, just saving the data to the database and then redirects back to whatever was the original page. And here are the validation rules. That's it, nothing really fancy. And maybe it could be optimized to not do repeating things I'm thinking now, but you get the idea. The main thing is wire poll, which saves whatever data you want to save every 10 seconds. If you want to get the full code of that component, again, you can go to livewirekit.com and purchase all the components, all 36, including like data table with filters, dashboard charts with live updates, and a lot of others, all for $29 at the moment. That's it for now and see you guys in other videos.